District food delivery drivers may end up getting a fine the next time they block traffic. It's an effort to stop drivers from double parking or blocking lanes. The D.C. Council is voting on the temporary legislation today. News 4's Juliana Valencia explains what's next. Traffic in D.C. can be brutal, and when ride shares and delivery drivers block lanes, it can only add to a commuter's frustration. That's why D.C. Council member Charles Allen is leading an effort to crack down on double parking delivery drivers. This started off from a conversation and trying to address a lot of transportation challenges in Southwest, but very quickly morphed into seeing this take place on many of our commercial corridors where the roadways get choked off by people that are just leaving their cars in the middle of the road. New temporary legislation would allow the Department for Hire Vehicles to give a citation to delivery drivers. Right now, the department can only find passenger carrying vehicles like Uber, Lyft, or taxis. The fines would not apply to delivery services like UPS, FedEx, or Amazon. Not everyone is on board, though. Councilmember Treyon White has concerns this would hurt the everyday worker. Most of these workers are trying to hustle to make ends meet in an economy that's becoming wider between the have and the have nots. And we are setting the precedence yet again for uh, giving tickets and, and to us people who are trying to earn a living. Northwest resident Lisa Dugan agrees with White and feels this wouldn't necessarily fix the issue of blocked roads. The idea of finding them as a way to try to address this issue, I, I wouldn't be supportive of it. I think that there are other creative solutions to find that don't put the burden on the average worker. Meantime, Enrique Ruiz sees how the fines could help keep more roads clear. So I'm generally opposed against fines for workers. However, I understand uh, the need to keep some areas safe. So I don't know if there's a way to just make it by zones, just the main streets. Uh, and also another thing to protect the safety of bikers, for example, when there's a parked car, make sure they don't run into them. The D.C. Council is in session right now, and this temporary legislation is on the agenda. If it passes, it still needs to go to the mayor for approval before it can take effect. In Northwest, Juliana Valencia, News 4.